So uh, if you could pick it up, uh, a construction file as built. Yeah. Can, can you hear me okay? Okay. So, um, yeah, you know, uh, the construction file needs specific scan points in certain areas uh, versus if you were doing it for marketing purposes, you may want to show right in front of the particular food uh, re restaurant so you can see the menu, right? Like you don't necessarily need that information for an as-built file. So yeah, that, that would affect knowing the use case and what they're going to use it for. Would it impact how I'm going to scan? Um, and some clients have a mentality of, oh, you know, we'll just kind of one size fits all. We'll have you scan the park and then we can use it for X, Y, and Z. And it's not always, it's not always that way. So did your client engage you for, I need the following spaces scanned and that might take three, five, seven, 10 days to do? Or did they say, hey, I got, we'll engage you for three days, get as much done as you can. Yeah, they had a list of spaces and they estimated it would take four days. Um, they didn't have a problem if I went over that, but I don't like to waste time and or money. So I was just, you know, knocking it out as I could. Knocking it out of the park. Good job on that. So, um, and, and and when you, you talked about seven hour days, I mean, and you did, you did, did you like literally take breaks? I mean, you had lunch. We, we know you had DoorDash delivered at least two of those days. Um, it, yeah. Did, 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 did you build that in to say, I just, I, I need to take breaks. Otherwise I'm going to kill myself doing this. Yeah. I mean, I definitely, you know, took, took bio breaks, bathroom breaks. Um, I, I took some breaks to go grab my water. Uh, I, I carry a big gallon of crystal geyser around when I'm doing projects and I drink that throughout the day. So I took some water breaks and I took a lunch break uh, and that, you know, it wasn't a, I don't think it was up to Cal OSHA or, you know, whatever the labor enforcement board is out here standards, but definitely took, you know, a good 45 minutes out of the day to replenish myself. So <clears throat> before we finish up here, is there anything that we haven't talked about about what you learned from using a Matterport Pro 3 camera to scan a baseball stadium? Is there anything that we, gee, oh, we should have talked about the following? Yeah. Um, I, I can't think of anything. I think we covered a lot of it. Um, Let's talk about your blog post, your video, other yeah. things that you're going to share even beyond being on today's uh, show. Yeah, so I made uh, a video and I went over, I showed the mini map of some of the scans that I did, uh, where you can see the the scan patterns. Uh, and I talked about that a little bit. Um, I showed kind of a high level overview of the actual tour. I didn't show the specific, I'm not going to share the tour link, um, or the actual tour, but I showed, you know, the dollhouse view of that. And then I went into detail about all the use cases. Um, so I think that's going to be super helpful. So I put the, all that together in a video and I'll release it, you know, when we're done with the call. And then I have a blog post, which is just a text version of the use cases that I'll also put in the forum as well so that uh, people can see that and feel free to cut and paste it and use it for your own needs. Awesome.